I am the CTO of Peer Index, which is providing a platform for people to understand their social capital. The overall concept is that people discuss influence in a generalized term, as in how people affect action. We focus on the actions that occur within the social sphere. And we help identify people that are effective word of mouth advocates for brands and other issues out there. But how do you get to targeting in geographies, targeting in influencers, as in how do you find the right influencer to talk to the person that's closing the sale? Most people say that the answer to that problem is data. Mm -hmm. but it seems to me that you have to know what to do with that data, what to look for, how to organize that data into something that relates to your campaign or your marketing strategy or whatever it is. What is it that we need to be looking for in the data to, to get to those second, third, and fourth level people that, that actually have real influence in certain situations? There's a couple answers, and it usually comes down to what you're using the data for. But I would say a high level way of looking at it is what would be called the deltas or the transitions because the challenge really exists, not looking at the static number, but looking at how people are impacted by the actions. When you as an agency are asking for the solution, you want to know, did it work? You don't want to just see data. They love numbers. Everybody wants to see numbers because you can give it to the brand, you can give it to the agency and they'll be happy with that but you want to know how did it impact the final sale? How many impressions? What's the example and what are some of the best practices that people could do?